All right, you've been committed to Ohio State for a long time. Yes. Yeah, but so many people want to know, you've got all these other schools still recruiting you. Yeah. Is there a number two right now? Who would be number two? Um, I can't really say. Um, but, I mean, they basically all tell me the same thing. I mean, nothing really different from, I mean, everybody telling the same thing. Miami, Florida, Florida State is really nothing different than me. But, yeah, that's. Is yeah. it those four then? The yeah. three in-state yeah. schools yeah. in Ohio State? You're, you're yeah. really focused on those four schools. Yeah, for sure. Okay. I mean, we've talked about this before. Do they have a realistic shot, the in-state schools? Um, Right now? or? Well, you, you uh, answer that any way you want to answer it. Um, I mean, I mean, I just gotta see how everybody do this season. I mean, the in-state schools. I mean, see how they do offensively. You know, Miami. I mean, they had problems offensively last year. Um, Florida, they had a little problems. Um, Florida State, where well, they Florida State did a little better to me uh, than both of the in-state schools. But yeah, that's. Yeah, so, that's are, are you do. saying if one of those schools had a very good season and impressed you on the field? That would improve their stock in your eyes and, and um, give them a better chance of. Oh you know. yeah, for sure. Um, yeah, they would definitely. They would definitely have a chance, probably. Um, but you've said it's not going to be easy to flip you. Oh yeah, for sure. It's not, it's not. All right. So with Ohio State, you know, uh, everybody talks about your relationship with Brian Hartline, but who else are you close with there? I mean, we get, there's got to be other people. It can't just be him. Oh yeah. Um, the head coach, Coach Ryan Day, um, Coach Keenan Bailey, um, Coach Coach Devin Jordan, um, <laughs> really the whole coaching staff, really. Man. Coach Tony Alfred, all of them, all them guys up there. Um, right. yeah. Ohio State's got a winning tradition. Yeah. They're putting all these receivers in the NFL. But what is it to you that separates them that's different about Ohio State from everybody else that's recruiting you? Uh, development that they have the last couple years at my position and I mean, the brotherhood up there in Columbus. I mean, it's real brotherhood. I mean, care for each other on and off the field. I mean, they play for each other each and every Saturday out there in Columbus. Um, yeah, that's, that's what it is. Do you feel as strongly about your commitment now as you did the day you committed? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah for sure. Yeah. It's just, so then why visit the other schools? I guess that's what you probably have to answer that I mean, a lot. You know, yeah. I mean, they in-state schools. I mean, they want me to come up, see, can they try to flip me? Um, they want a shot, too. So, I mean, I just wanted to get them a shot. Okay. Um, I mean, it's part of the process, so, you, yeah. You were just at Florida for a couple of days. Best part of that visit was what? Um, Really just sitting down with Coach um, Billy Napier and Coach Billy G. I mean, both of them guys, I mean, Tell me how they use me in the office, offense. Uh, tell I come in, make your guy come in and be a game uh, uh, program changer right away. Um, I mean, you seen what Coach Billy Napier did with Calvin Ridley at Alabama his freshman year. He had a thousand yards, 88, 88 nine receptions, and so I believe seven touchdowns. That's big for a freshman. Um, yeah, that's that was stood out the most. Did you learn anything new on this last visit? On this visit, or was it, was it just a matter of you know? Continuing to be comfortable there, or oh yeah, you know, for what, sure. yeah building continue, relationships. Yeah, building relationships, and yeah, I mean, I seen what they could do do to, do with me in the offense, move me around, move me uh, be outside, move me to the slot, find a way to get me the ball. That's one thing they kept hitting on and uh, on this visit this past weekend. All right, we asked you this about Ohio State. What about Florida is different from the other schools? Um, really, just I mean, DJ Lowey, uh, Coach Billy Napier, them guys. I mean, they just. They just, I mean, they respect my commitment. Um, really just, I mean, they just both great guys. Came, Coach Billy Napier is a great guy, great head coach. Um, DJ is a great quarterback. Um, he respect my commitment a lot. Uh, he said, either way you go, you're going to be great. And I believe the same thing for him. I mean, he going to do good at Florida to me. Yeah. He, he has said, hey, I'm not going to force Florida yeah. down Jeremiah's throat. He's yeah. not that kind of guy. Yeah, yeah. He's just befriended you. You guys have become friends. Uh, but what kind of recruiter is he? Oh, he's a, I mean, he's more chill. He's chill. I mean, you know, he respects the commitment that I have. I mean, he told me that's a great school. You look, you going to. Uh, they say, why not come to Florida and change it around and be a creature on legacy? But I mean, you got to have them guys do the share of them at Florida. That's that's the key to that's everything. Key you you yeah. you're, you know, I, I spoke to your dad earlier, and he said, hey, we like Florida a lot, but yeah. it's about yeah, that season. So, how much about the season is it for you? Uh, really, just. I mean, the offense, how they looking. Um, yeah, that's really how winning and yeah, just how the offense looking. Is it a that. place you could picture yourself at? Oh, yeah, most definitely. I mean, great quarterback. My class, in the class that they had, DJ Lightway. Um, I mean, they got a lot of great guys that's committed in the class. Um, yeah, that's, yeah. Uh -huh. uh we don't haven't talked about this too much. We just have a few more questions. Billy Gonzalez, you mentioned you, you talked to him earlier. What kind of relationship have you developed with Florida's receivers coach? What do you think of him? Uh, we have a great relationship. Uh, me and Coach Billy G. Uh, Built it over the last couple of months. We've been talking. Every time I go up there, I have a great time with him and his off in the uh, receiver room. Um, really just sitting down and. I mean, he really care about his players a lot. I mean, really, really do care about his players. I mean, he still keep a contact with some impressive coach from 2000, 
they were national nice championship 2006. Percy Harvin, all them guys. Um, me and the greatest shit. He's a he's a real. Every time I talk, I talk to somebody who coach who they who he coached at Florida. Um, they tell me he's a great guy. He really he really go take care of. You. Last question about Florida, and then uh, yeah, if you were to pick Florida, what would be the reasons why? What, what are they making you? What are they giving you to think about? School, uh, school football. Yeah, school, oh yeah, definitely. School, yeah, school is great. Uh, the, edu the education at Florida is really great. Um, that um, for Billy Napier and DJ Lowe, for Billy Jim, them three guys right there, them they would be the reason why. Your, your family was up there with you. What do they think about UF? My mom, she 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 likes Florida a lot. Uh, dad, he, he likes it. My little brother, he likes it too. Um, Got to ask about FSU. You were just there too. You spent a few days on campus. Uh, what did you think of that visit? It went great. Um, just sit down and you know have a great time with the coaches and stuff like that. Um, really just, I mean, yeah, just enjoy myself. Really. What what what, uh, what about them is different than everybody else? What's unique about that program, that school? Uh, the the tradition that they have. I mean, Coach Coach Noville, He told me my freshman year that. Um, we go. He go get the program back to where it used to be, and he really, he really is doing it right now. Um, I mean, he's a player. He's a player coach. He go push each and every day to be the best version of yourself, and that's one thing I like about him. Will you visit Florida and Florida State, and Miami this fall for games? Oh Those yeah, three? for sure. Yeah, okay, for sure. and Ohio State. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. And then last question: we're, we, you made it. You've done a great job. Yeah. Uh, final decision: Is it going to be on signing day? Is it, are we all going to have to wait till signing day? Or you think you may? Potentially shut things down before then, or just have a final determination. Uh, it, dep it depends on um, how how everybody do the season, and yeah, just. So you're not sure. I'm not. Yeah. Not yeah, sure right yeah, now. Yeah, comfortable. Sure. Just in a nutshell, comfortable yeah. with your Ohio State commitment, yeah. but want to give the in-state schools school, a chance, chance basically. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah. All right, Jeremiah Smith, number one player in the country. Thanks for your time. No problem.